Welcome to a special edition of Student of the Gun University Man Talk. We are at Student of the Gun University today, and thank you for joining us. If you do us a quick favor, wherever you happen to be on planet Earth, go ahead and sign in and share this with two people, because they're not going to want to miss it. Thank you for joining us on a Sunday. I know that many of you are relaxing, but we thought we would give you an extra special bonus today. How are we doing back there, Shipping Ogre? Doing all right. Doing all right. Shipping Ogre's here with me. Uh, you can't see him, but he's in the studio with me. And he says we're doing well. Do we, is there anybody watching us right now? 32 people, actually. There's 32 people with us already. Thank, thank you very much. Has anyone signed in or checked in? Yep. They Paul have? Hudson and Ruben Payne. Well, fantastic. Fantastic. Hello to everyone. James Markle. And uh, what time is it right now? It is... Um, what time does it say on the phone? 12.29. It says 12.29. So in one minute, we're going to go ahead and begin our... Sp are extra special, and this is on first aid for men. I know many of you are probably wondering. Uh, questions? Any questions? All right, comments? What's up? What's up? What's up? Uh, from Chris Folsom. Okay, the uh, the shirt is from Swat Fuel. Yes, it is. And the hat is from PHU, my Piper Union. And uh, we did a little quick survey about whether or not our fans liked the hat this way or whether they liked it this way. And it turns out that they like it this way better, so uh, I, I'm nothing if I'm not a people pleaser. Oh, you want me to activate the asshole filter? There we go. Asshole filter is activated. Men, are you tired of going to the cupboard, grabbing the box of Band-Aids, only to find it's empty? How many of you have kids? How many of you have wives? You go, once in a while, you cut yourself. You go to the cupboard, you pull out the box, and it's empty. Or you pull out the box, you grab a Band-Aid, you put it on, and it won't stick to your manly skin. You can't get it wet. It's worthless. I don't know about you, but I'm tired of that too. I've experienced the same thing. I have kids and wives that go through Band-Aids like toilet paper. And every time I go to the cabinet to get a Band-Aid, there's not one there. And I was sick of it. So I came up with the Mandaid. That's right. And you can do the mandate yourself at your home. Here's what you need. One roll of duct tape. Any color with do, will do. I decided to use the flesh color. And one bag of cotton balls. 200 cotton balls, $1.88 at Walmart. This, about three bucks at Walmart. So for $5, I can make at least 200 bandages. Think about the economics. Think about the savings. Now you say, but Paul, I can only make so many Band-Aids. Right. How many kinds of Band-Aids do you want to make? Well, how do you do it? You take a strip of the duct tape, you take a half a cotton ball, and bam, what do we have? We have a Band-Aid right there. We have a Mandaid. Now, you might just eat a little tiny Mandaid. You can make a little tiny Mandaid right there. You see, I've got one right there on my finger. You can make a regular size Mandaid to put on your thumb. Let's say you've got a great big cut. Stick three or four cotton balls on there, and you've got a big manly size mandate. You say, but I have kids, and my kids aren't going to go for this. The kids don't want a mandate. Aha! The kids will want a mandate. When you come home with this, you've got the Finding Dory tape right there. You can make yourself a mandate or make your kids mandates with Finding Dory tape or Hello Kitty or whatever they happen to be into. So, it's as easy as this. One roll of duct tape one bag of cotton balls and what have you got you've got yourself a mandate make it any size it's naturally waterproof and it'll stick to your manly skin and your days of running out of bandages are over i hope you appreciate it this was a special student of the gun first aid for men edition now if you like what you saw great if you don't well goodbye but you can go to studentofthegun.com to get everything you say, well, how do I hear more? How do I watch more? How do I read more? I'm glad you asked. Go to studentofthegun.com. Click the big orange button that says seven life-saving uh, tips that could save your life or seven training tips that could save your life. Sign up. You'll get the electronic newsletter. Say, I don't want the electronic newsletter. That's cool. But if you go to studentofthegun.com, it'll tell you where you can watch the TV show, where you can listen to the radio show, where you can read the articles, buy the books, and all that good stuff. All right. Any questions from the audience? Zach? Ah, uh, good question. Are there any questions? I know this is a quick down and dirty, but hey, it's Sunday. I'll let you get back to your day.
Doesn't seem like it. All right, kids. Thanks for joining us for this special edition, and uh, have a great weekend. Mwah!